Are you planning to see the Señor Santo Niño in Cebu? Look no further. Welcome to the Basilica del Santo Niño de Cebu. Founded in 1565, the Basilica stands as one of the oldest Catholic church in the province of Cebu. In the 18th century, the shrine of the Santo Niño was completed, and it was in this period that work on the beautiful paintings of the church's ceiling was completed through the leadership of Father Pedro Espinera. Through the years, the church would get numerous additions like the Pilgrim Center, where devotees can attend Mass, the candle lighting area, and the Santo Niño Chapel. This is where the original image of the Santo Niño sits, the same one brought by conquistador Ferdinand Magellan in 1521. Of course, once inside, it's best remember that you're entering a place of worship, so enter with the proper decorum. There are plenty of historical artifacts from the Vatican City, sculptures that visitors of the Basilica can appreciate, and there are even paintings that depict the journey of Cebu's people in meeting Christ. Cebuanos take pride in the historical fact that Cebu is the birthplace of Christianity in the Philippines. This is seen in their practice of devotion to the Santo Niño through the Sinulog Ritual Dance Prayer. So, if you're ever in Cebu, don't forget to stop by the Basilica Minore del Santo Niño and offer a prayer to the child Jesus. This fiesta, Senor, say pit, Senor, and enjoy the magnetic power of God's love.